Good morning, my name is Andy from the Gobbo's Grotto. Um, this is one of the last videos I'm going to do for this uh, Skaven pitch build. Um, I just wanted to show you the board before I pour the resin. Um, this is the bit where I'm uh, worried about um, the resin pour. The last resin pour I did, I used a cheap version and um, and it ruined one half the board. So I've bought a better version. I've been I did a little test sample, but it does kind of eat into the foam. Um, so I've been PVA gluing the foam to try and get a protective barrier. Uh, so this is what the board looks like pre-pour. I hope afterwards it's going to look awesome. Um, so just to go over it, uh, we've got the uh, two different sort of ends. Um, and this is the, the kind of line of scrimmage that's been demarked by... Uh, the tentacles coming out of the the kind of sides there to kind of go into the wide zones, and then obviously this big thick um, green mossy uh, line down the middle kind of breaks the the board in half. Um, you've got one glowy green symbol, and then a gory red symbol, some blood stains, and bits and pieces. One there's the kraken coming through the bottom of the floor. These are the dugouts. Uh, that's the away dugout um, and the home dugout and some little extra details in there. And that's a dice tower that's made to look a bit like um, a sewer pipe. And then it goes into a, a scatter template that's built into the board. I haven't done any scoreboards yet. Um, mostly because I'm trying to figure out how to do a scoreboard with re-rolls and stuff like that. And build it into the board. But... Um, it will come to me, I'm sure. Uh, I'd like to you know make it into integral into the board, but I'm not sure how. Um, so any suggestions are really helpful. Uh, this is the uh, the hoardings that I've downloaded off uh, the internet, um, and they look they look spot on. I really like those. I've just put those onto coffee stirrer boards um, and glued them together. Um, and uh, right at the very end. Hopefully this is going to look kind of cool. Um, I've added some spooky Halloween lights I got from Poundland. And uh, they light up basically the dugout, which I think looks kind of cool. And this little part here with the throwing template. Um, that will be hidden under the board there um, with a little piece that goes over the top. Um, and that when it in, will hide all the wires and everything else. So that's the board. Hopefully the resin pour is not going to look too bad. So this could be my last vlog entry, but um, hopefully not. Um, I'm just going to do the resin pour in about 10 minutes. I won't do a video on the resin pour because uh, it's just a slow boring process where I just mix some resin and pour it into these these wide zones and then over the throwing template. Um, but hopefully in a couple of days I can show you the results. Um, thank you for watching the build so far and all your comments. Um, on Facebook and here in YouTube. So thank you very much. Uh, my name's Andy from Degobo's Grotto.